Tonight, the NYPD says they got their man. Frank James, who went from person of interest to prime suspect today, is now under arrest. He was taken into custody just before 2 this afternoon in the East Village at St. Mark's Place and 1st Avenue. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor live in the East Village tonight with these breaking details. Alice. We're here on First Avenue between St. Mark's Place and East 9th Street. This is where Frank James was arrested earlier this afternoon, as you mentioned. Police say he made no attempt to resist arrest. He also made no attempt to hide after yesterday's attack. They say he was simply out here walking in the open. Cell phone video shows 62 year old Frank James being taken into custody by NYPD officers after multiple sightings of him were reported today. A crowd gathered to watch. He was quiet. I didn't see him carrying anything because his hands were handcuffed. They put him in the car. He did not say anything. He grabbed him and he, and he just put his head down. Police say a Crime Stoppers call came in, placing him at this McDonald's nearby. But when they showed up, he was gone. NYPD patrol officers from the 9th Precinct spotted him walking at First Ave in St. Mark's Place. I will see him. He have bag in this uh, bag, and he was walking the sidewalk, and he put the bag in the street. Police sources say he was carrying a backpack and had a metro card on him, a phone, and a Wisconsin driver's license. Thirty-three shots, but less than thirty hours later, we're able to say we got him. This afternoon, the NYPD thanked everyone, the public, and other agencies for their help. We used every resource at our disposal to gather and process significant evidence that directly links Mr. James to the shooting. The FBI is also asking anyone with additional information on his whereabouts to come forward as they better try and piece together a timeline. Live in the East Village, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. Okay, Alice, thank you.